Hi guys, welcome to Rapturous House. My name is Tanya. I hope you all are doing absolutely, absolutely wonderful. Today's reading is going to be for my Sagittarius. I want to see what's currently going on with you guys, okay? I do want to thank you all. I want to thank you all for all your likes, all your shares, all of your comments. They're all greatly, greatly appreciated. If you haven't yet subscribed to the channel, please do so. That way you'll get notified anytime I upload any new video footages, but also that way I'm able to tug on your energy. Okay, guys, please remember only take what's yours. Leave everything else behind. If you guys would like a personal reading, my website's information is down in the description below. That is the only way that you're able to obtain a personal reading. Okay. I am my loves. I do call on the Holy Spirit. I call on the white light that guides us. I call on the goddesses that gives us our strength and the angels that protect us. Let's see. This is going to be for my Sagittarius. Let's see what's going on. What's currently going on with my Sagittarius spirit? Ooh, six of wands. This talks about recognition, accolades here. Public recognition here, public reward here. Some of you guys could be could could like horses, like you may train horses or you may ride horses. Hmm. This this is telling me that some of you guys are artists, or you're very gifted, very creative. There's there's a, there's a gifted energy that's coming through here. King of Pentacles, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn energy. Hmm. Some of you guys, you may be married to somebody very successful. Are you yourself? You could be very successful. Yeah. Four of Cups. Some of you guys, you may be in a relationship with somebody here and they're their work and their success you're somewhat over it you're somewhat over it it's like wanting something for yourself for some of you guys show me more what's going on with my sagittarius the empress oh i love that energy you guys are vibing high very grounded energy you guys like nature some of you guys could have a garden in your yard you may spend time out sunbathing laying on the grass working in your garden some of you guys are artists the empress taurus libra energy coming through this is telling me you guys are you're winning as a mother figure here this is a divine feminine energy coming through some of you guys are mothers and you're a very loving and nurturing mother. You are. You have some very intelligent children with that six of wands. Or there is, there's recognition for, this is like somebody giving, praising you for being such a good mother. Six of swords, moving on to calmer waters here. Or some of you guys, you may have a very successful mother. But that Six of Swords talks about moving on to calmer waters here. Some of you guys may be traveling soon. Or you may be relocating. This is like leaving one country to go to another country. Leaving one state to go to another state. But this is crossing a big body of water here. Someone here is like, you, you did that. Like... This is where your success and your victory has come through by you relocating yourself, you moving yourself away. You moving yourself away, four of wands. You have a successful relationship and our marriage here. Hmm. Show me spirit, show me what I need to see. Somebody here, you may have relocated for a relationship. You, you may have moved away from your family for a relationship or for the fact that you were getting married, King of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces energy. So there's someone here in your energy here that, that is very, there's a lot of emotional maturity 
with this person queen of wands aries leo sagittarius energy i feel like this is your energy there is somebody here that's very emotionally immature that's in your energy this person's in love with you this person's in love with you this person is 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 very empathetic this person is very attracted to your spontane spontaneity they're very attracted to your differences there's cultural differences for some of you guys this person's very this person finds you to be very good looking and very attractive you're very courageous and fun you're different to whoever this person is while this person's very grounded there's a playfulness energy that surrounds you i feel like you guys are very much in tune with your, your with your feminine energy there's a lot of feminine energy that's coming through here you guys are very much so in tune with your feminine energy here but i also feel like you're very in tune with yourself like you carry yourself with so much confidence i feel like you guys carry yourself with so much confidence show me show me what's going on with my sagittarius right now present moment spirit What's currently going on? Ace of Wands. You're, you guys are being inspired. You are inspiring. You guys are, in, you guys are very inspiring, but you yourself, you're being inspired right now, present moment. Knight of Pentacles, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn energy. There's some things that you're working on. There's some things that you're creating. There's some things that you're drafting that you're drawing up right now, present moment. You guys are very gifted. You guys are very gifted here. Knight of Pentacles, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn energy. Some of you guys, there's someone here that's very slow moving here that you're extremely attracted to. There's a lot of attraction between you and this person. Some of you guys, there's someone here. This could be an earth sign. This person, this person inspires you. They inspire your craft. But I'm also getting like slow progression. Like you having to stay, stay diligent, stay, like stay grounded in your pursuit to create whatever it is that you're trying to create. And I feel like it has to do with your abundance. I do. I feel like it has to do with your abundance. Show me more. What's going on with my Sagittarius? The chariot, cancer energy. Some of you guys are traveling. Are you planning a trip? Some of you guys could be getting a new car. Some of you guys, you could ride a motorcycle. But the chariot talks about forward movement. It talks about breakthroughs here. I feel like some of you guys are planning to travel, planning a trip here. The sun, Leo energy. This talks about healing and hope. You guys are being inspired you are, you're being inspired to do more, to do better. Some of you guys, this there's a relationship that you're in right now, present moment, and there's like a newfound love and respect for this person. There's an energy here of like a newfound love and respect for this person. Things are moving along in a positive manner for you and this person. Show me more. What's going on with my Sagittarius spirit? Five of Wands. Huh. There's some gossiping going on. There is some gossiping going on. Three of Pentacles. Hmm. Some of you guys are surrounded by jealous individuals, people that talk about you. Could be people that you work with. Some of you guys, you're, you're in an industry. You're in an industry where there's a lot of competition. There's a lot of competition here. Some of you guys, your spirit guides are, are, are kind of letting you know that you need to work on your mastering your skills more. I see communication though. You may find that there's someone here that wants to work with you. You may receive some good news here. Someone here, they've seen your work. 
And this person wants to work with you. Yeah. Let's see. Show me, Spirit. Show me what's going on with my Sagittarius. Show me what's going on. Flirt. Extend your lighthearted energy to others here. I do see where there's people in your energy. There's people want to work with you. There's people that want to connect with you. There's people that find you to be very gifted. Show me more. What's going on with my Sagittarius spirit? Show me. This could be the one. You're, you've already met the romantic partner you seek here. I told you. Like, I feel like there's some type of new inspiration. You know, this is like rekindling of love here. This is like rekindling within a relationship here. Becoming more playful in this relationship. Show me more. What's going on with my Sagittarius? Unrequited love and calling in your soulmate. There's not enough attraction or chemistry to keep this relationship going here. Your prayers, affirmations, and visualizations help bring you together here. I feel like whoever this is that you're interacting with, again, I feel like there's some type of new inspiration here. I feel like this is like an energy here of, again, rekindling a relationship, rekindling the romance in a relationship here. I'm also getting a, a feeling of somewhat lonesomeness, but your prayers, your affirmations and your vis visualizations, your prayers are, your prayers are being answered here. I feel like your prayers are being answered here. If you truly believe, I want you guys to put in the comments, I believe. I feel like your prayers are being answered here. Hmm. Let's see. Why is the six of wands here for my Sagittarius? Why is the six of wands here? Page of swords here. Some of you guys, you, you're in the public's eye. All right, some of you guys could be a student. But this is like learning. It's like if you want to be a celebrity, if you want to be a well-known artist, if you want something, there's something here about you wanting it. But there's also something here about you needing to work on those skills, work on growing those skills. Because the Page of Swords is a new energy and it's like newly thinking about something. You know, these are, this is, you've made up your mind. This is like freshly making up your mind that you want something, you want to do something. And this is your attitude and your belief here. And this is also the actions that you take towards it and these actions if you want to be successful if you want a public recognition if you want reward and accolades you need to learn something you need to educate yourself you need to investigate you know the moon cancer pisces energy this talks about your intuitions here hmm i feel like some of you guys know it's like what you want, what you truly desire. Do you really and truly know what you truly desire? Let's stop there first. Do you really and truly know what you truly desire? Have you taken the time to stop and think about it? Have you taken the time to stop and try to figure it out for yourself in some type of way, shape or form? Because that moon also kind of gives me a feeling of illusions around it. But also the things that are hidden, like not actually publicly, like this is like doing work, but not actually putting it public. This is like doing something, but never, it's like not coming out the closet, that type of energy. Hmm. Show me the Empress for my Sagittarius. Show me the Empress. 
the high priestess very some of you guys you have a, a very spiritual uh, you have a prayer warrior mother or you yourself you could be very you could be a prayer warrior but this is also telling me some of you guys you're very there's there's, there's a, you're very religious in your own way the high priestess is very in in the empress this is telling me you're 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 very spiritual and you're very much so a divine being very spiritual, very much so divine being. But not only that, this is also telling me that you may have a mother figure in your energy. That person is that for you. That person is that for you. Four of Pentacles. Hmm. You know, Four of Pentacles is holding on. Why do I feel like some of you guys, it's like you're you're still holding on to a part of yourself that you that you you've disconnected from this could be something from your childhood or something something about your upbringing here like still kind of holding on to a part of yourself here knight of pentacles like you're still holding on to it's like almost like still holding on to a life that you've already let go of or that you should have let go of hmm why is the high priestess here for my sagittarius why is the high priestess here? Eight of cups. See that? This talks about emotionally detaching, walking away. You see, this is still holding on to certain things that you've already let go of or that you do need to let go of. Because there's an energy here of you being bigger and better and different from what where you come from. Yeah. Strength, Leo energy. Same energy. You know, it take it took a lot of strength for you to take this journey. It has taken a lot of strength for you to take this journey. Show me this King of Cups for my Sagittarius. Show me this King of Cups, Eight of Swords. Hmm. There's someone here that feels stuck. Five of Pentacles. Uh, what's going on here? It's like I have to ask, are you in a relationship that you don't want to be in anymore? Are you in a relationship? It's like being in a relationship with somebody that loves you, that you can't love back. That message is meant for someone. It is not meant for everybody. This is like being in a relationship here with someone, but feeling stuck. But feeling somewhat stuck. Why is this Eight of Swords here for my Sagittarius? The Chariot, yeah, Cancer Energy. A lack of forward movement. A lack of forward movement here. Three of swords. Heartache and pain. For a small group of you guys, there may be something third party here. Hmm. That's a strong energy that's coming through. Why is this ace of wands here? Some of you guys, there's somebody new here that has sparked your sparked your interest. Or there's something new here that has sparked your interest. Why is this Ace of Wands here for my Sagittarius? Queen of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius energy. Yeah. You, you're you're inspiring right now. You're inspiring and you're being inspired. You're being courageous to go after. This is like pursuing your artistry, pursuing your passions. The emperor, Aries energy. This is a father figure. This is a husband. This is head of household. Hmm. 
This person is fine, though. Whoever this person is, this person is fine as hell. Is this someone else? Some of you guys, you got somebody that's all in love with you. And some of you guys, you are you got somebody else that you're interested in. Some of you guys, you have somebody that has bank. Like you have like a big business person looking at your work, looking at your skills, looking at your artistry, looking at your talent here. And that in itself is inspiring. The Empress. Mm, divine counterpart here. Some of you guys, while there is somebody else that may be in love with you, you've you've met your divine counterpart. Yeah, could be with somebody else. Because this talks about situationships. Hmm. Show me. Why is the chariot here? Why is the chariot here for my Sagittarius? Ace of Pentacles. Some of you guys, you got some money coming in. This talks about a new opportunity, a new proposal, a new job. Some of you guys could be auto mechanics or you could be good with your hands. But I see money coming in. I also see an opportunity here coming in for you. Two of pentacles. Some of you guys, you're in between. You're, you're in between two different paths here, two different people here. Hmm. Show me this five of wands. Show me this five of wands for my Sagittarius. Two of wands. You have to decide. Some of you guys, you have to decide betw between two people. You have to decide between two peoples or you have to decide between two courses of action. There's either two people here or there's two courses of action here. Eight of wands. But see, this momentum... The momentum is gaining. It's getting serious. This is getting pretty serious. If this is you, let me know in the comments. Put this is me. Because the momentum is gaining. Some of you guys, you're needing, you're going to have to travel. Yeah. All right, my loves. That is what I have for you guys. If any of this resonates, please hit that like button. If you would like me to do more Sagittarius readings, Definitely let me know in the comments. Until next time. Bye, guys.